Hi, everyone, and welcome to the June Tech Talk on using Acrobat JavaScript with Forms. My name is Lori Kasub, and I'm the Community Manager for AcrobatUsers.com. Today's presentation will be detailing how to use Acrobat JavaScript within your PDF forms. We'll be detailing the basics on how to enter scripts, how to perform common tasks, and the do's and don'ts of JavaScript and scripting that will work in Adobe Reader. As just a reminder, this Tech Talk is being broadcast voice over IP, so be sure to turn your computer speakers up. For the best experience during today's session, be sure to use a wired connection, not wireless, and to turn off other computer applications that may take up bandwidth. If you still experience any difficulties, sometimes exiting the room and then re-entering will resolve the problem. This Tech Talk is also going to be recorded, so you can come back and review portions of the demonstration at your leisure. We will post the on-demand version on AcrobatUsers.com later today. We will also have sample files available for download at the end of today's presentation. Feel free to submit your questions in the Q&A chat pod once the session begins. Before we get started, I'd like to invite you to answer a few simple questions. We'd like to understand what version and type of Acrobat you use, as well as if you're familiar with any scripting, and the frequency you expect to use scripting in your forms. This will provide Tom some useful background for his presentation, so I'll give folks a minute to fill out the polls here. It looks like almost everyone's finished uh, answering the polls. And most of you are using, at this point, Acrobat 9, the pro version, with some experience in JavaScript, uh, just simple scripting on the forms, the, the plans. And do you plan on using the form technology for Acrobat forms more than lifecycle forms? So thanks, everyone. Appreciate your feedback. And now I'd like to introduce today's presenter. Tom Parker is one of the most active experts on our site, especially in the JavaScript and Forms forums, where he has answered thousands of questions. He's also an Acrobat consultant with his company, Winjack Solutions, where he spends much of his time developing custom scripted solutions for clients and providing online training in Acrobat and PDF scripting topics. Thanks for joining us today, Tom. Uh, thank you, Lori, and welcome. Oops, sorry about that. I us go up to the front and welcome everybody to inside the Acrobat JavaScript SDK. So a little variation on the, uh, the topic that Lori mentioned, but <clears throat> it's actually along the same lines, only a little bit broader. So uh, as Lori said, my name is uh, Tom Parker, and I'm the creator of the pdfscripting.com website, where you can learn all the gory details about scripting for Acrobat and PDF. So that's my shameless plug for the day. Uh, so let's get started right away on what is an SDK. Uh, the, the Acrobat SDK, or any SDK, is a software development kit. This is a pretty generic term, and it's used to mean a lot of different things for a, a, a lot of different people. But for Acrobat, or for a lot of programming environments, we can think of the SDK as the overall scripting environment. And the things that you need to actually develop code in that scripting environment are a programming language, a library of relevant features, and we need ways to use that pro we, have, we need ways to enter code, run the code, and debug the code. And this is what we're going to be covering in this session. I'll pre be providing a bird's eye view of the Acrobat scripting environment and how it all fits together. So what I want to do here is to give you the essential information that you need to get started in scripting. But we will be looking at some specific form details. And in fact, there are a couple of example files that I have posted in the share pod that Lori will show at the end of the session. These are two forms, one acro form or acrobat form and one lifecycle form. And uh, I designed these forms to cover all the sort of main aspects of form scripting and those two different forms technology. And I'll be touching a little bit at the end of the session, I'll be touching a little bit on those forms and some of the scripting specifics. 
However, as we're going to see in just a little bit here, uh, form scripting is only part of the overall Acrobat JavaScript environment. So to start off, what's JavaScript? JavaScript is, of course, the programming language that's used in PDF and Acrobat scripting. JavaScript is a full-featured programming language. Now, for a programming language, it's a very simple one, but it's more than just a simple scripting language. It really is a complete programming language. However, JavaScript doesn't stand on its own. 